This facility will provide a bed to 50 men who are currently without one. Living in tents, they're couch surfing, they're living in cars and unfortunately some of them are living under bridges. It will help a portion of the over 2,300 Tasmanians who said they were homeless on census night. But the government's released a new strategy to end homelessness altogether by 2043. We understand that the strategy sets out a, um, a high-level aspirational target. We think it's important to be aspirational in terms of the targets that we set. We're talking about making sure that incidents of homelessness are very rare, they are only ever very brief and they don't reoccur. Colony 47's Mara House provides medium-term housing to young women under 20. The residents are supposed to leave after nine months, but a lack of social housing means that's not always possible. We often do keep young women here a bit longer because there is um, not, at the moment, play other places for them to go. The service provider says the strategy is short on detail. If you want to have no homelessness by 2043, surely the best way to do that is have early intervention strategies with young people from now, and I feel this has been a really big missed opportunity. This is the latest in a long line of strategies about how to ease Tasmania's housing crisis. It hinges on the government meeting its target of 10,000 more social homes by 2032, but it's currently falling behind. We wouldn't have put it in there if we didn't think it was deliverable. Again, it's a, uh, it's a target that we need to be held accountable to and we need to tick off the progress towards that target, but we absolutely believe it's achievable. Adam Langenberg, ABC News.